Be Larry. He, has, um, he owns an English school, and I used to study there a little bit. And most of the resources that teacher uses over there, it's song too. Right. Uh, this is song. Great. They give you a they give you a paper with the lyrics. Yeah, multiple choice and com yeah. uh, filling in the blanks, exercises, mm -hmm. and all yeah. that. It's nice. It's mm -hmm. very nice. Mm -hmm. It's a good way to understand English. Well, when you think, yeah, even even more than that, when you think of everything that that you can get from a, from an exercise like that. Uh, Sophia. One thing is, Steve, are you gonna get some eggs? Please. One thing is, you do not learn a language if you do not learn the culture that goes with that language. Yeah. I mean, it's not just vocabulary. Think about right. this. Uh, you're very young, but somewhere in the 70s and 80s, people wanted to create a universal language. And they called it Esperanto. Esperanto. Esperanto, which is Esperanza. Okay. Hope. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, and everybody, and people were enthusiastic all around the world. Yeah, we're going to have a common language. We already had a common language, which, which was English. But people wanted to get that, you know, oh. hegemonic thing of Americans, English, their, their language and their money and everything. They separate the culture now, from the Now, this professor who was a Yugoslavian or Czechoslovakian, the one who created Esperanto, what was the one thing that, quite the idea, never really caught up because they didn't have a culture behind the language. You it was need sterile. Lan they didn't understand the language have to, language is, is, is the wrap of a cultural phenomenon. Mm -hmm. it's, you have, language steps up and leaves through a culture that, ex that it expresses. If you don't have that, then you have no language. So, the, the, tip so the typical e English language school when we teach just grammar and some vocabulary lists and a dialogue. Oh, we're going to teach you a dialogue, right? Uh, it's yeah, sterile. You teach a culture and then within the context of that cultural situation, then you, you teach vocabulary and language and, and, and how it happens in, in you know, formulas or these or these are communicative situations or 